Oh my God, we just filmed an entire video and realized this mic was sitting over the other side of the room. So take two. Let's get yep. straight into it. This is check-in number <laughs> two. So we have had a bit of a mixed month, haven't we? And it's time to obviously have a brutal, honest review of what's been happening. So my starting, I'll start with me. My starting weight was 138.7. My last or first, my first check-in was 133.3. My check-in for today is 132.3. So I've officially lost a kilo, not entirely happy with my progress. Um, I did fluctuate a fair bit within the last four weeks um, since our last check-in. There's definitely some more work that I can do around my eating and calories and all those other things. So we'll talk about that in a moment. Matt, how have you been? Okay, so start weight was 93.8 kilos. First check-in last month was 89.9 .9 and I was excited. Now. I had a big blowout with just falling off the wagon completely. Been working hard the last couple of weeks and have brought that down to 90.6 kilos this morning. Okay. So I guess I've you know lost throughout my journey, I think 3.2 kilos yep. uh, so far. So yep. I'm, yeah, I'm happy about that. Yep. Uh, but I'm not happy that I've actually gone up point seven yep. over the last month. Yeah. In total, mine's 6.4 kilos, um, which I'm really happy with. But again, there's definitely lots of room for improvement that I can do and that I know that we can both do. Talk, let's talk about what has been working for you. So what's been working since starting this process? I guess the thing that's really been working is not getting Uber Eats and getting up because I go to bed at 10 o'clock at night. So getting up at five o'clock, getting to the gym, going out and doing some cardio and sticking to 1500 calories per day. That's what's been working when I've been doing it. Yeah. But I think doing and starting uh, to do that program called 75 Hard uh, last month, I basically bit off more than I could chew. I tried to sort of run before I walked and I literally just had a bit of a blowout but just overeating calories. Yeah. You know what I mean? Just leftovers yeah. in the fridge so of kids' food yeah. and stuff like that. Just you know, <laughs> whatever, pass late at night or I know this of the enemy. <laughs> I know this story all too well as yeah. well. But my goal for the next month is so I'm I want to get down into the 120s. I haven't been in the 120s for probably three to four years. Wow, and how will that make you feel getting in the 120s? It would, it would make me feel incredible. It, for our next check, next check in, I would love to be at one in the 128 range somewhere. So around 128, Yeah, perfect. My goal is to get into the 80s. Um, so I want to be 88 kilos or less yep. uh, by our next check in. Boom, awesome. It's just getting my mind dry, you know what I mean? And I think just slipping into old habits. And yeah. I think we were just both, we talked about it uh, in our first take, uh, <laughs> that we actually need to work hard, not be lazy, and just really, it comes down to how much we want it. Yeah. Um, and I think that's yeah. just, I, I've been lazy. And I think that I've let myself slip and it's not good enough. And it was a bit of a wake up call today's video and that's the purpose of them. Yeah. To actually have gone up 0.7 is a bit disheartening. Yep. Yes, I'm glad I'm down, you know, 3.6 kilos. That's nice looking at this yep. from the start of the challenge, but I want to make sure I actually rein it back in, yep. get to my 88, you get to your 128, yep. and um, we can be excited sitting here this time next month. 100%. And so one of the, the biggest challenges has been for me, again, what you talked about is just overeating so I've got a really like I've I actually started going to bed earlier um, and been reading at night and things like that that's really helped me in my process with waking up in the morning um, something that's been going really good but what's actually um, has been what I've been struggling with is the calories and so what my commitment is from here on um, at least sorry for August for every day in August is to jump back on my fitness power mm. that is a really good way of tracking your numbers um, it's obviously worked really well for me to begin with um, but just having the visibility of knowing exactly what you're picking up and what exactly what that costs on your body mm. um, and then the after impact of it 
to get to the numbers on the scale that I'm looking to get to. So that's my goal. I know it's possible. Um, so if you're on MyFitnessPal and you want to join me or add me, I'll put the details down below. Um, but yeah, that's, that's my commitment for every day in August to track everything that I put through my body. Awesome. Um, and mine's 1,500 calories a day and getting back to bed on time so I can get up and exercise. Boom, all right. So hopefully a bit more of a positive video next time. Let's get it. Woo!